What is up guys, in this video I'll show you how to stream games from your PC to your Android phone or an Android tablet. So first off, make sure you have a GeForce GTX graphics card which supports game streaming to a Shield device. More on that later. And now, go to the Play Store. Uh, search for a software called Limelight. Uh, this is the one, Limelight Game Streaming. Go ahead, install it. And why do you need, uh, we need a GeForce GDX graphics card? Is because the PC requirements uh, of this software requires you to run a graphics card which supports NVIDIA game streaming. So, yeah, for people using AMD, you're out of luck. But let's go ahead and open this. Now, wait for it to search for your uh, game streaming PC. Mine is showing up right here. If yours, do, yours doesn't show up, uh, you can add it manually by entering the IP address. Uh, let's go ahead and pair my computer. Now it'll ask, it'll show you a code which, uh, which you'll need to enter on your uh, computer. So the code is 6852. 6856. So now we click connect and now the game list should appear on your Android device so I'm gonna go ahead and launch Dota 2 let me just put the camera on a tripod stand So as you can see, effectively what's going on is the what, whatever is appearing on my desktop is being mirrored onto the Android phone. So what I can do is turn the monitor off and use this to play the game. So let's go ahead and spectate someone. By the way, you can connect a keyboard and a mouse through the USB on the go. You can buy one of these cables and connect a regular PC mouse and a keyboard and play the game. Or you can use a PlayStation controller. So let's wait for the game to load. So there we go. Yeah, it's running quite nice. Dire structures are fortified. Dire's bottom tower is under attack. Dire's bottom tower has fallen. So let's go ahead and try another game. Let's go ahead and try trying. Oh, I think this game requires me to connect a keyboard and a mouse. So let me show you guys. Uh, let's 
So now uh, my keyboard is connected to my phone. So as you guys can see, I can use a regular PC keyboard to control it. And yeah, uh, there are no lags uh, at all. Everything is running pretty smooth. And yeah, I can't play this game without a proper uh, dock for the phone. But yeah, it, but but I really wanted to prove the point you get to think that you can stream your PC games to your phone. So I think that's it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching, and yeah. If you have any questions, do let me know in the comments down below and I'll be more than happy to answer it. So thank you for watching the video guys and stay tuned for more. See you guys later.